Hey, this is Eric here at Perkins Motorplex in Paducah, Kentucky. We're here on Park Avenue in Paducah. There's the main drag of Park Avenue. Our, our office building here. We've got a whole other side of the lot over on that other other side behind that sign. But over here on the sedans, the car row here to take a look at this 2017 Passat R-Line. Really good looking car. Uh, 80 some odd thousand miles on it. We'll take a look on the inside as well here in a moment but wanted to check the exterior for you show you everything i can see on it first of all of course stands out with those sharp drag wheels those are i believe 19 inch yeah 19 inch wheels great set of goodyear reliant rubber on them super deep tread really sharp come around here on the front has as as expected a little bit of wear here on the front of the hood couple little scratches there some just some road road wear on the front of it and you've got a little bit of a, a little, something spilled on it but that's that's something on the paint right there here it is from about I don't know three three feet away and from the walking around about six feet away of the car Nothing terrible, but again, want to show you what's there. And just a few scuffs here on that hood. Got a few there, a little bit of scratch there, some surface rub. Uh, you can see on, on that hood. The front bumper, which lots of times you do get bugged up. Uh, it, it actually looks really good. I don't see any cracks or anything along it. I do have the car running just to keep that AC going, because of course it is hot again today. Looking down this passenger side, I don't see any major dent. One little ding, I don't know if you can see it from here, in that passenger door. We'll take a look at it. But again, the wheels, tires look great. Lots of times this side mirror's bugged up. That looks good. The windshield looks good. A little scratch here just above it on the, on the hood, or on the roof, small. And I don't know where was that. Very, very small. If you can even see it, just right there. Probably won't even show up in the video. But uh, along this door, just again, just a little bit of scuff on the passenger door. Rear has one little bitty door ding right there. Again, I don't know if that will show up at all. Maybe a little bit right there. Back door looks good. Has, I don't know if any, I don't think it has any tint on it right now. Again, aftermarket wheels look great. No scuffing or curbing on them. Really good shape. Badging looks good. Very little, very little age to it back here. But again, just some surface scratches actually that's just some wax remaining there but just a few little scratches across it there another couple right there Winch, uh, rear rear window looks good the rest of the roof looks good rear bumper good shape I'm getting the r-line black trim along the bottom and down the driver's side looks excellent. Don't see any dings along these doors. It does have blind spot monitor on the side mirrors. Getting the R-line badging. Let's take a look on the inside here. Power driver's seat. Excellent interior. I mean, that's, the seats look like they hadn't even hardly been set in, so they've withstood all the driving that it's had. Plastic is not scuffed up. Smells great. No uh, smoke or odd odors. No perfume or uh, you know air fresheners or anything like that. Just smells good. Seats are great. Let's open up the back. Yeah, very very good shape in here. Perforated 
leather interior. Backs of the seats are good. Doors look good. Lots of times this will get scuffed up or where your arm may have rested or something, you've got that worn down. All that looks good. Sometimes it'll be gouged, but looks good there. Let's close this door. Turn the air down a little so I can hear me a little bit better. Again, got the touchscreen infotainment. Does have the backup camera and grid lines. Bluetooth capability. Hands-free controls here on the steering wheel. So you can see all that. It does have heated leather seats. Dual climate controls. Automatic climate. 87,953 on the odometer. Automatic headlights. Adjustable steering wheel. It does have two keys. Turn, it is a, uh, like a switchblade key. So turn key ignition. Dash is in good shape, not sun sunburnt or, or worn down. Again, got some wear and tear on the exterior areas, but the interior, I don't see anything at all. Uh, I guess that's another trunk release. Change tire pressure or anything, change tires, it just sets your uh, TPMS sensors. Do have uh, auxiliary and USB, little cubby hole there, two, two cup holders here, uh, leather wrapped steering wheel with the flat bottom, very ergonomic, very nice. And of course, your stereo, FM does have CD, uh, of course, Bluetooth capability, as well as auxiliary. Power mirrors, power windows, everything here working properly. There you go. And your overhead dome lights there. A little bit of uh, sunglass storage. Everything looks very clean on the inside. Like I said, it does come with our 30-day powertrain plus guarantee as it's been fully serviced and inspected, but we've got much longer term peace of mind available with our bumper-to-bumper -bumper factory top coverage all the way up to 60,000 miles, which you can take to any repair facility of your choosing, as long as it's a certified technician. Once again, this is our 2017 Volkswagen Passat R-Line with comfort package here at Perkins Motorplex in Paducah, Kentucky.